Zimbabwean senator has been elected on a pause as the president of the Pan-African Parliament, becoming the first delegate from the Southern African region to take up the top seat of the Pan-African Parliament. And after getting the backing of the Southern and Northern African regions, Fortune uh, Chamunbira election went successfully without any hindrance amid last year's chaotic electoral process, while some express hope on the new Pan-African Parliament leadership, the chairperson of the African Union Commission calls on members about the significance of protecting the image of the institution. Let's have more details of that in this report. The election of Fortune Charumbira is history in the making. He is the first delegate from the Southern Bloc to take up the top seat in the Pan-African Parliament. His election into the presidency of the legislative arm of the African Union concluded without incident. Last year, the Pan-African Parliament could not elect new leadership after proceedings descended into chaos when members of parliament could not agree on the principle of rotation in the five regions. This time around, Charumbira's bid for the presidency seems to have been clear-cut after getting the backing of the southern and northern regions. He was elected unopposed as Malawian candidate Yeremia Chahana's nomination was cancelled because it had not followed the AU's protocol. The principle of rotation provides for the pub presidency to rotate among the five regions of the AU, namely North, West, East, Central and Southern Africa. It is followed by the AU in all its organs as a means to unite the continent. I am very happy that uh, Chief Charambura actually expressed the sentiments of unity, they expressed the sentiments of development, and expressed the sentiments of focusing towards doing the right thing. The African Union Pan African Parliament was created for economic inter integration. We have to pursue our mandate for economic integration because otherwise the decolonization of the African economy will never be addressed. Reflecting on last year's chaotic scenes, the African Union Commission Chair Musa Faki Mohammed gave a stern warning to the delegates. In his opening remarks to the ordinary session sitting, he told them that it's time for the Pan-African Parliament to clean up its battered image. The time has come that we turn this uh, very sad page of the annals of this institution and start anew. So it is high time that we renew with, uh, a, with a behavior that has always marked uh, the Pan-African Parliament and which has been a source of pride for the African Union. It is high time for the brotherly dialogue in a peaceful atmosphere should prevail over confrontation. The African Union had to step in and bring its legal counsel this time around to elect the president and other representatives. Cherumbira is a traditional leader and a Zimbabwe member of parliament. He has previously served as one of PAP's four vice presidents.